lot of them. This is actually called a black-footed albatross. We actually received the bird from a um, rehabilitator in South County. She actually received the bird from uh, a fishing boat that came up out of Baja, California and came into San Diego. Okay, so then fishing boat owner found the bird on the deck of the boat, knew something was wrong, and so did the right thing, got it immediately to a wildlife rehabilitator. Um, well, the bird is down, the bird wasn't flying, um, she was having difficulty with the rehab process, has some sort of contaminant, something on the feathers. We don't know what it is, um, just some sort of contaminant on the feathers, so that's why one of the um, things we're gonna do is, because we, we just got the bird yesterday, so we're gonna do a wash. We've already done a physical, we've already done blood work, we've been doing supportive care for the bird since yesterday. So now it's time to get that contaminant off the feathers and then let's start them through the rehab process. Because this is a bird that lives out in the ocean. These birds are like um, pretty common like out in the Pacific. They breed actually out in the remote Hawaiian Islands. So these guys make their living out at sea. The only time they normally come into land is for breeding. The bird has to preen to realign all those feathers so that that waterproofing is really good. We'll get a really nice look at that tomorrow when we first start to put him in the pool. We'll see if there's any areas where he's, you know, um, not waterproof there, if he's preening. A lot of things, these birds can fix themselves once we remove the major contaminants. So we're going to start feeding him outside in the pool. We've got squid, we've got krill, we've got um, some special Kaplan smelt and everything for them. These guys are really heavy squid eaters. So we've got that. They're surface feeders. So hopefully once we get him out in the pool, he's going to be dabbling and just grabbing up food. So that's what we're hoping for tomorrow.